Hey YouTube, welcome back to another video. So this video is going to be on the second game for the event, which is Infinity RPG. So, this game is actually kind of old. They've updated it constantly though. I haven't played it since 2016, which for some reason I disliked it three years ago. And that was when I was 11, wow. But... Yeah, that was also, I played this before I had, I had less than 100 Robux at the time when I played this for the first time. But yeah, this video is going to be on the event for this. It says, venture through the new Glacier Mountain map and ascend to daring heights with the all new ascension system. So, they added a new system where you can basically re-earth. Where it says you have to be level 1000. And it says you can ascend every certain amount of levels for free stuff. And then it will bring you back to the beginning. But keep your items from codes, ascensions, and stuff. And you can earn... A whole bunch of stuff with the system so it's pretty good there's one problem though you need to be level a thousand and i'm level 140 it does take a while to level up though but in this video since it's just on this game i don't think there's any active codes right now for this game because there are codes right there but anyways, in this video, I'm just going to be leveling up and showing you guys some of the places. So I can go to the bosses over there. I want to do the level 150 one, so I'm going to level up in the... I can level up in this room, and then once I get to level 145, then I can go in the next room, and then I can become level 150, then go to the new boss. Or not the new boss, but the next boss. So. This game does seem pretty good. They could make it better though. I think these are still the default models they made in 2016. So it would be nice if they improved the monsters. So that they could become like better graphics and everything. And if they made a new system of an inventory instead of having the default inventory. But I level up around every two kills at the moment. So that's kind of good, I guess. And for some reason, some bosses teleport you back to the beginning. And some of them, you can just farm them. Like, the boss in the area before this, it teleports you back to the beginning, and then this one, you can just farm it as much as you want. Someone in my server has a 1 ascension, so... I'm guessing it just gives you a pretty nice sword, and then... Yeah, I'm guessing that's basically it. It could give you other bonuses, but... I just think it's like that. This is a really nice RPG since it's the first RPG with the rebirths, like an actual normal RPG. I know there's RPG World and Slaying Simulator, but both of those you level up for items and stuff. And this is just the regular RPG system thing where you get items from shops and boss drops and everything. So this is the first like actual RPG game to have stuff like that. So, there are a whole bunch of areas. This area is level 50 plus, so I'm going to go exploring this area. And the mobs here, I can want a shot, but they only give 10% every time I get them. And sometimes I need two hits. The mini boss only gives me like 20%, but it does respawn pretty quickly. So it might be a good idea to farm this. And the max level is, was raised from like 
I think it was 1.5 million, and now it is 3 million. So that's pretty nice. I've never met anyone more than level 200,000 on this game, but I haven't really played it that much, so that probably makes sense why. Okay, now I have 140, so I'm able to go to the next area. This game will be very fun, especially when you get more things in the game. You can unlock more areas. But this game is very nice. It has a whole bunch of areas, but it's kind of unorganized because there are teleports to random places and there's random places everywhere. So, it is nice though to have randomness like that. But, yeah, I just was able to come to this new area. So it looks like there's dinosaurs here for some reason. And I'm level 146. They only put, like, half. Wait, I can equip armor here. Level 175 and level 200. So... The one in the last area gives plus 1,000 health. This one only gives plus 2,000. I mean, plus 1,250. So it's not really that much of a bonus to get the one from here. And the boss area here is level 170. I haven't gotten any of the drops from the bosses yet. Besides the one I already owned from 2016. Because I played this game until I was level 123 in 2016, so that was a lot of playing this game. I just need three more levels. Actually, well now, two more levels, and then I'll be able to go to the next place. The boss fight. And hopefully I win, but I'm definitely going to stop by the last area first to get some armor so that I don't instantly die. And levels correspond with what weapons you can buy in the shop, and coins don't really matter. But I have 1.30 million gold. I'm level 149, I just need to get one more of these dinosaurs, and then I'm able to level up and go to the next area. But this game has a lot of time and effort in it, but they really should improve it and add the send button somewhere else. Because the UIs are pretty unorganized, like those are both square and touching the edge and this one has rounded corners and is not touching the edge. So it would be nice if they added the send button like right below those. That would make a lot more sense in my opinion. I'm gonna check the sword shop to see if I can buy anything new. So that's what I own, and this one, it's only 35,000, and it does 300 to 600, so I'm buying that one definitely. So I went from 125 to 175 to 300 to 600 damage, so I'm definitely probably going to beat the boss this round. I just need to go back real quick to get the armor from the other area so that I increase my health from 1,500 to 2,500. Since that's nearly double. And the stuff over here. Plus 1k health, plus 4 walk speed. And there we go. And now... I look pretty weird. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna go to the boss right now. So that's the 50, that's the 100, and wait, no. 300. I thought uh, the next one was 150. Maybe they removed it or something. But that's what I remember from earlier. I can still do this boss though, and maybe I'll be able to get this boss. I haven't visited it 
since whenever I joined, I assumed I wasn't going to be able to get it. And I just attacked the level 51. But I won against that boss. Wait, Ancient Legend. Yeah, I think that the boss gave me a sword. The sword only does 125 to 200 damage, though. I'm not completely sure how this works. I think I can... Yeah, good, I can sell it. So I can view all my items here. And... Yeah, I'm just gonna sell them all since I do not need them. Wow, oh, some of these actually do a lot. And it shows the levels and everything, so this is pretty fancy. So... Wow, I just got back, well, it did cost 30-something thousand to buy the sword, so now it only sold for 8,000. That doesn't seem like that great of a deal, but now that I have this new sword, hopefully it doesn't take longer to kill the dinosaurs. Okay, now I can do it in four hits. That's pretty nice. So, anyways, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Make sure to subscribe, join the Discord and Roblox group in the description. And, yeah, quick shout out to my channel members. Currently, I only have one, but if you want to see your name on this screen the next time I record a video, then just join my channel. But yeah, shout out to them, and yeah, this is the end of the video. Bye, YouTube.